this was a real difficult one for us. I mean, really, we didn't have anyone to turn to in terms of uh, trying to sell it. Uh, I've done some work on it. I've got some answers for him, and I'm going to see basically how he feels about what I'm going to offer him. In Gosport, thrill seeker Nick still has mixed feelings about selling. I'm not worried about what James will say at all. I'm confident he's going to say yes. But if he says no, I'm not disappointed. Hello? Mickey? How are you being? All right? Yeah, I'm doing really well. Well, look, I mean, it's uh, a really interesting item, as you know. And, uh, we've never Thank seen you. anything quite like it. Well, I haven't. And it was great to try one out. And I had a field day down there. <laughs> Well, I mean, as you know, it's not an easy thing to value by any means. No, of course. I put the figures out. I yeah. did a bit of research. Mm. And um, at one point, to be quite honest with you, I didn't think I was going to find anyone for it because it's such a difficult thing to try and, uh, you know, cult like that, where people don't actually know what you're talking about half the time when you're trying to describe it. But I've actually found a guy who wants to take it away. He's really, really interested in it. He's come back to me with an offer. Right. And the offer is 25 grand, mate. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, that'll buy it. Wow. So you're happy with your 25 grand, mate? Oh, yeah, of course I am. Of course I can. Appreciate what you've done. What I'll do is I'll get all the paperwork and I'll get the uh, funds over to you. All right, anyway. Cheers, nice mate. talking to you. Bye bye. Bye. What is that? 25 grand. I mean, he wasn't jumping up or down, but. Uh, I don't think that Mick is a sort of jumping up and down type of person. What we girlfriend will say is, well, it doesn't really matter, do it? <laughs>